This video is to introduce the Grid Damper, an adaptive power grid oscillations damper. Grid Damper is the winner of the R&D 100 Awards of 2021 in the IT and electrical category. R&D 100 Awards is often called the Oscars of Innovation, which is the only science and technology awards competition that recognizes new commercial products, technologies, and materials for their technological significance that are available for sale or license. The winning products and technologies are the 100 disruptors that will change industries and make the world a better place in the coming years. Why we need the grid damper? Large-scale electric power grids have oscillatory behavior similar to a swinging pendulum. If not sufficiently controlled, these oscillations can cause serious damage to power equipment like generators and even lead to major blackout events that cost billions of dollars. These oscillations are becoming more severe, frequent, and complex with the rapid development of renewables and power electronic equipment in power grids. For example, the video on the right is a severe oscillation event that happened on January 11, 2019 in the U.S. Eastern Interconnection. Effective suppression of these oscillations is essential to maintain a secure and reliable operation of the power grids. Grid damper is a disrupting technology. Its innovative design enables the mitigation of three major types of oscillations. Natural oscillations by intrinsic system characteristics, forced oscillations driven by external periodical sources, and subsynchronous oscillations caused by interactions between renewable plants and the power systems. The adaptive capability of grid damper guarantees the optimal control performance under varying power grid operating conditions. It adaptively chooses the optimal sensors, actuators, and automatically updates the control parameters. In the following slides, we are going to first talk about how the grid damper operates with its adaptive control. Then, its performance will be presented on large-scale power grids, both in the United States and around the world. Power grid operating conditions change due to the variations in load demand and power generation. These variations are common in power grid daily operation and become more frequent because of the intermittent nature of renewable energy sources. Grid damper automatically monitors the oscillations with real-time measurements. It updates its choice of sensors and actuator equipment that have the optimal observability and controllability of the oscillation, and at the same time, it updates the control parameters accordingly. The figure shows an example in the Western Interconnection in the U.S., where grid damper automatically changed the sensors from AB to CD as the operating condition changes. It also changed the actuator from the solar and wind farm to conventional generators with updated control parameters. Although the controller updated for condition 1 suppresses the oscillation quickly as shown in the left figure, its performance drastically degraded when the power system operates under condition 2, as shown by the red curve in the right figure. After the adaptive functionalities are turned on, the oscillation was quickly damped even in a very different operating condition, as shown by the black curve in the right figure. This unique adaptive capability is available in the damping control of all three types of oscillations. The grid damper has been implemented on hardware and various testings have been conducted in a hardware in-the-loop testing platform using a real-time power system simulator. We are going to present the performance of grid damper on a number of large-scale power grids of EPRI members. First, we will focus on natural oscillations. The continental Europe power grid experiences a 0.293 Hz natural oscillation between the north and south. An actual oscillation event that happened in December 2017 was replicated to verify the performance of grid damper. The oscillation was triggered by two consecutive generator disconnections in four minutes. The grid damper detected the natural oscillation and activated two synchronous condensers in the south. The video on the right is a comparison of the oscillation dynamics with and without the grid damper. Without grid damper, the oscillation kept growing. By contrast, when the grid damper is in service, the oscillation settled quickly in three seconds with a magnitude close to zero. Another application of grid damper to natural oscillations is in the New York State power grid. 
grid damper detected two natural oscillations, the west against the north and the west against the south. The oscillations were quickly suppressed with grid damper's action on a voltage compensator. The control can be executed through conventional generators too. Also, grid damper is able to deal with various types of communication uncertainties. The video on the right shows a comparison of the oscillation dynamics when the uncertainty handling function in grid damper was activated and deactivated. The oscillation was sustained and kept growing without the uncertainty handling function. When the communication uncertainty handling was in service, the oscillation settled quickly within 20 seconds. The grid damper also detects and controls forced oscillations. In the U.S. Eastern Interconnection, an oscillation event happened in January 2019 with a driving source in Florida. Based on simulations, grid damper was able to quickly detect and forced oscillation and executed fast control over energy storage facilities to greatly reduce oscillation energy to a safe level. This prevents equipment like generators from damage and allows the grid operators sufficient time to locate and remove the driving force. In the United Kingdom, subsynchronous oscillations may happen in the power transmission network due to interactions between renewables, HVDC, and the power grid. As an example, an artificial 10 Hz subsynchronous oscillation was created in a simulation model, representing the UK grid after 2030. The grid damper was able to detect the 10 Hz subsynchronous oscillation and quickly deployed control on the high voltage DC link in the north to settle the high frequency oscillations. Grid damper can also prevent system separation and improve system transient stability. The Saudi Arabia power grid was forced to separate into two islands on November 4, 2017. The figures on the right show a comparison between cases with and without grid damper. Based on simulations, grid damper implemented on generators and voltage compensators effectively damped the oscillation and prevented the system from separation. Grid damper is the first of its kind technology that can mitigate all three major types of oscillations and at the same time has the adaptive capability to handle the varying grid operating conditions. It is robust against communication uncertainties and has the flexibility to work with various kinds of actuators. Grid damper has been successfully implemented on hardware and tested on four realistic power grids in the U.S. and around the world. The New York Power Authority in the U.S., Turna in Italy, the National HVDC Center in the U.K., and the Saudi Electricity Company in Saudi Arabia. Field deployment of the technology is happening right now in the control center of the Italian transmission system operator, Turna. Thanks to Electric Power Research Institute's vast power industry members both in the U.S. and internationally, Grid Damper has a huge array of potential applications, and we are excited about its bright future in facilitating a greener and more secure power grid. Thank you for watching.